A little hose water never hurt nobody. Hey, hey, everyone. Welcome to my channel. What's up, Grand Bam? How's everybody doing? Come in and let me know. Today, I'm going to be showing y'all how to boil and eat crawfish the way we do it. Okay, so first thing, first things first, can't talk right now. When you have your sack of crawfish, if you're not quite ready to boil it, you always want to wet a towel, a big bath towel, just soak it down, and you cover your crawfish with it. That's going to help keep them fresh and alive and good to go. Next thing you're going to do is fill up your pot with water, shaft. Don't worry about the water coming out that hose. That's just how us Cajuns do it. A little hose water never hurt nobody. And you always want to make sure you have one of these to boil your crawfish and make sure it's full because if it's not full, guess what? You got to run to town and get a new one or fill it up. Also, guys, what we do, we get the ice chest about a little less than half full of water. That's to purge the crawfish. And what we mean by purging is we get all the mud out of them and you put about a quarter cup of salt to the water. You don't want to over salty it. And when we're ready to cook, we're gonna purge them first. Also, we have a little tip on the crawfish. When you buy a sack of crawfish, you wanna make sure that the sack is tied real tight and the crawfish are real tight in there. That way they don't kill each other because if the sack is loose, they're gonna kill each other. Food for thought. Also, what we like doing is making a dip for the crawfish, but we also eat it on crackers. Let me show you the ingredients for this dip. It is amazing. You're gonna love that if you ever try it. Okay, this is the ingredients for the dip. Cucumber, celery, bell pepper, onions, lemon, Louisiana hot sauce, Heinz ketchup, Ritz crackers, and Hellman's mayonnaise. And you cut all that up real, real fine and put, mix it all up, eat it on those Ritz crackers. Mm -hmm. These are the ingredients for the crawfish boil. You have lemons, garlic, onions, potatoes, Zatarain's liquid crawfish ball, the bag, and Martin salt, made here in Louisiana. Oh yeah, and if you don't have a little alligator to hold your seasonings, you not Cajun. Guys, Chichi has pink eye. He's not feeling well. He's got the pink eye. He wants to hide under his blanket. Okay, when you're ready to start boiling, you just add your seasonings to the water. That's the Zatarain's liquid ball. Of course, we always use white pepper. We love white pepper around here. Also, you put crab ball in a bag. We use just one bag. Put salt, but you wait till the water's boiling to put your salt because if you put it before the water's boiling, the salt will settle to the bottom and it will eat away at your pot. It will damage your pot. Like, for real. I'm serious. Because we got all the fixings that go into the crawfish ball, you want to cook these first. That way you can add all the flavor to the water. And then after all this is cooked, you pull it out and you add your crawfish. Louisiana style, baby. Get it all in there. Like that, chef. Papa's pulling that crawfish out, putting it in here, getting ready to put it in the pot. Don't worry about that mop bucket, that mop bucket just for the crawfish, y'all. See that water boiling? Here come the crawfish. Pulling them in. Oh, yeah. 
yeah. Once the crawfish is in, you're going to cover your pot, let the water come back to a bowl, cook it for 10 minutes, and turn it off. And let them sit for 5 minutes. And then pull them out, and they're ready to eat. Alright guys, crawfish is done. I'm going to show you how we eat that here. This one got some big claws on them. A lot of times they just pull right out of there. Look at that, look at that. And you suck that claw. Nothing but the flavor comes out of that juice. It's so good. You eat that meat? Mm -mm. I'm going to pull this tail. You just twist it off. That head right there, don't lose it. Yeah. Most people like peeling that first layer. I don't because I just put it in my mouth. Pets and pull. Mm -mm -mm. Then there's fat in the head, and fat is where all that flavor is at. You gotta get all that fat out, and you just eat that like that. And if there's juice in the head, you suck the head too. Mm -mm -mm. So I said, ball wear. So good. All right, guys. Now I have. Remember the dip. Let me show you how we eat that dip real quick. Real, real quick. I'm gonna peel the tail real quick just to, because you know, you gotta have that crawfish on there too. Peel that real quick, give me a cracker. It don't matter if that get all over, it's okay. You put your little piece of potato, you get your piece of potato. Put that potato, well you grab you some dip first. Grab you some of that dip. Look, look how chunky that dip is. Hoo wee. You put that potato right there. And you take that crawfish right there and you put all that in your mouth. All that. Make your eyes grow back in your head. I ain't lying. If you like my video, subscribe, like, and share. And come back for more because there will be more. Much love. Peace out.